Is it important to fully unplug for some amount of time, or do you kind of still stay plugged in? Yo, I mean, it's the football. You're literally in the middle of the football season. You can't truly unplug. Uh, for some guys, it's different. Everyone's different in, in their own way. And as long as you come and stay correct and stay true to who you are, I think you'll be fine. On Sunday, do you become a bit of more of a football fan? Uh, yeah, I watch a couple games. I watch games that my friends are a part of, um, but I don't have cable, so I don't really watch football. How do you feel about this defense after the last uh, game? A lot more confidence? Yeah, it's nice to see the defense really fire on all cylinders. Um, the, the hard part is doing it every game, and that's all I care about. I don't care about just one game. I want to see what we can do throughout the entire season. Are the donuts and beer in the same setting? or is it? Yeah, typically beer is at night, donuts in the morning. Uh, I'm not a beer guy myself, but I am a donut guy, so we'll see how many I eat this all season. Do you get out of town or you, you stay away? I stay around. Yeah, we have discussions every now and then. So what types of things are you tying the players in here? Don't say their damn money. Yeah. That's just an overall general concession, especially for young guys. They like yeah. to spend their money, and they don't really understand uh, the importance of having money throughout the off season. So um, even if without any negotiations, I tell guys to save their money. But um, what we're going into now definitely save their money. Do you guys usually come and ask these questions about Oh, yeah, that's awesome because guys yeah. actually come up and, and talk to me and ask me questions, so i got to be on my toes and understand um, the ins and outs of it. I don't always know the answer. I hit yeah. up Lester, our, our rep, and he gives me some answers, so um, I'm just a liaison between both. I think you had mentioned back in the spring that you never let what come in affect what goes out, right? Like, did you say you set yourself a budget when you got in the league? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I stick to my budget. I've been at the same budget for about a year now. I had the same budget for my first three years. I upped it a little bit yeah. so I can give my parents some nice flights coming in and some nice rental cars and stuff like that. Um, but I'm a simple man. You know, It doesn't matter how much is coming in. It's, I'm going to spend my budget and stick to my limit. Yeah. So what have you found are some of the more effective ways to tell guys about these saving methods? Um, just really just... I guess understanding taxes, number one. Yeah. Uh, number two is understand that you're only getting paid 17 weeks out of the whole entire year. Right. So you're going to save a considerable amount of your check. I know it's a big check coming in, but yeah. you've got to understand you have, you know, what, I 40, yeah, you got 35, 40 more weeks to live. So you yeah. got to make sure you're spreading it out and, you know, you're, you're budgeting so you're not going to lose money when it comes you know, May or June and you're begging to get to get a contract in, in August. So. Yeah. What's uh, the best tip you've given them? Budget. Just really, just budget. Don't spend over your limit, man. There's really no reason. There's not much stuff. Not much happiness comes from stuff. Um, just keep the main thing, the main thing. Your family, your friends, and forget the parties, forget the private jets. Yeah. You'll be okay without it. Do you ever talk to Jerry about some of the CD stuff? Given that he's going up to Chicago. No. 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 Yeah. Can't do your thing at all. yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate no it.